Barry Manilow. Oh, I'm rubbing it. Oh, I'm rubbing it. Barry Manilow. Oh. Fuck you guys. Get the hell out of here. Shit. I do like Barry Manilow. He's a good singer. Turns out the toughest guy in prison history was a Barry Manilow fan, and everyone feared him in prison because he was a good fighter, like a cage fighter, like UFC. He was the most dangerous dude, and he was a big Barry Manilow fan. Facts. Look it up. Actually, you probably, would, probably can't look it up because it was on a prison show I saw years ago. Um, this whole video is dedication to John Schneider, the founder of Papa John's. I'm a huge Papa John's fan. Go, pa go Papa John's. I hope Papa John's uh, becomes president again and owner of Papa John's. John Schnatner. Schnatner. Yeah. Schnatner. Schnatner. You deserve it, man. Cheers to John Schnatner, Papa John's. big Walmart fan too. Uh, I'm going to use this uh, for target shooting my BB guns. I'm saving this can. My Red Rider. Red Rider video one day. Found this at the, um, went to the thrift store today. It's the only shopping I did on Black Friday. By the way, Walmart has the best, the best grade meat, according to Gordon Ramsay, and all the best. Walmart hamburger meat and steak. So go to Walmart, support Walmart, support my fetish. Actually, that's the reason. Uh, there's a Black Friday trample uh, stampede. <sighs> Turns me on thinking about it. This will come in handy. Cost me two bucks. Dishwasher. Oh, yeah. I want to break this fucking thing off. I don't know how to do it. I need a hacksaw or a chainsaw. I don't think. I don't think this will. Might. I don't know. Let's see what happens. Saw maybe tomorrow. I'll saw. I don't know. There's one more than one way to skin a cat. This is, oh man. I got Quigley down under at the thrift store. Good movie here. Cider House Rules. If you haven't seen it. If you haven't seen this yet, check it out. Um, big in the uh, Stone Cold. I'm going to get uh, um, that, one st that one Stone Cold movie looks really good. It's called um, Package the Package. But this one's uh, recoil is pretty good. I used to have um, um, it was called Punish or uh, I forgot the name of it. Uh, called something. Uh, it was good. They, it was like a, then I got Ray Stevens. Hell yeah. Um, this actually came with um, 
Reader's Digest, Ray Stevens Live, 30, 90 minutes of Ray Stevens Live. Nineteen ninety two, the best year of my life. Music and girls. That's all that mattered. Basketball. I used to play the piano, make my own music, even though I couldn't read music. I just made up my own music. Hey, as long as you piddle on the keys, who's to say what's music and what's not music? As long as it sounds good to you. Oh. Shit. Fuckity fuckity. Well, you know, I mean, hey, it's, uh, oh, it's Friday night, All in the Family, I'll watch All in the Family later, I got brats and my mom, actually, my Thanksgiving sucked, hold on a minute, really did. Um, my son, Thanksgiving was, um, lousy, crummy, because, well, you know, hey, some people don't even have them, but whatever, but usually, well, in my experience in my life, it's usually include, involved my dad, my mom, my sister, and that's it, you know, you, most of the time. This time, my dad wasn't there, it was just my sister, my mom, and me, that was it. I was sat at the table, I, I was like, man, I was on it. I don't cook the uh, two turkey breast and legs and a, a slow kick cooker or a crock pot because our stove don't work and she put stuffing in a smaller crock pot and, like the stuffing was kind of good and mashed potatoes was too creamy she put cream cheese in it for some reason you couldn't taste the cream cheese but she said she put cream cheese in the mashed potatoes I heard of sour cream but never cream cheese but whatever but she had Hawaiian rolls uh, a little butter on that and then she had peas and carrots, they were alright, and then stuffing, stuffing wasn't bad, and brown gravy, brown gravy was too watery, runny, but uh, it was okay, I had pepper to it, and the turkey, because it was cooked in a slow cooker, or a crock pot was rubbery, breast, but tonight I'll try the legs, and I'll let you know tomorrow, I got, as a backup, in case I don't like that, I got brats, I'll just fucking microwave them. Uh, actually, I could, actually, I could just pan fry the fuckers. Just throw them in a pan, some grease. But uh, no, I'm I'm finicky and I'm picky and I'm choicey about like who cooks my meals and who prepares my food, who produces my food, who who does my food. You know, I'm not just gonna eat any fucking plate that I see just because I see a plate. You know, I gotta know who. Who's the fucking person making it? Because I know damn well I'm a fucking awesome cook. <laughs> Just like John Schnatter, he's confident. He should be the one in charge of Papa John's. <sighs> These lame, whack ass, all about politics shit, you know. It's a trouble with our country. It's too modern. The hell with the. New politic system shit going on uh, with uh, Trump, and all this crap going on here, all this stupid shit going on here. I'm gonna do one more video, so stay tuned.